Welcome. I'm Synergy Shaley. I'm going to do a little introduction on this video. I have been teaching yoga for two years now. I've been certified with my 200 hours restorative yin yoga as well as chair yoga. I have been doing yoga since 2015 when I was introduced to it by one of my health teachers in high school. So yes, I have been doing yoga for quite some time. I am now just recently certi certified. I realized after I came back for RVing um, around the US for three months, I realized that that was what I wanted to do. So here we are. Let's go ahead and get down on our mats. Thank you for joining me. We're gonna go ahead and get into half lotus pose. So stacking the knees on, well stacking the legs on top of each other, the ankles on top of each other coming into this triangle position. We're gonna go ahead and inhale our hands above our head. Exhale, bring both hands, palms together to heart center. Exhale. We're gonna twist to the right. Palms are still together. Extend the arms long. Five, four, three, two. Palms together. Twist back to center. Inhale your hands nice and tall above your head. Look up past your thumbs. Exhale, palms together, bring those hands down. Twisting to the left, taking the arms long. Five, four, three, two, one. Palms together and coming back to center. All right, let's go ahead and come out of that. We're gonna go and switch on to the other side. So bringing the left on, ankle on top of the right. And from here, we are gonna walk our hands forward, bowing our head. Inhale, exhale. Our pelvis is tipped forward, so all the water would be falling out the front. Inhale, exhale, walk the hands back to center. Take the hands on the hip, and we're just gonna pretend that our hips are a bowl of water. We're gonna go ahead and just kinda take this bottle of water as if we're moving it in this circular motion. You can make it really dramatic. You have really big circles. You have huge circles if you want to get really dramatic and have really big circles. Or you can have really small circles. You can start big and then come back, come smaller. Whatever is comfortable for you, this is your practice. All right, let's go ahead and switch sides. Really start to feel that spine and those obliques working together. Take those hands nice and high into the sky. Inhale up, look up, exhale, head down, chin to chest, head, hands follow, palms together to heart center. Let's go ahead and come out of that pose. We're gonna come into child's pose. So go ahead and take the knees out to the side of your mat. Tops of your feet are relaxed, toes are touched. Go ahead and take that bolster pillow, set it right behind you, sit back. Go ahead and take your hands out long and then bow your head down to your mat. I am courageous, I am beautiful, 
I am smart. I am flexible. I am comfortable. I am anxiety free. Go ahead and walk your hands back up, coming out of child's pose. Go ahead and come onto those knees. So knees are stacked and we're kind of sitting on that hip here. We're just gonna go ahead and kind of take our hands above our head and then fall to the side. Three, two, one. And we're gonna fall to the other side. Three, two, one. Go ahead and come on up. This time we're gonna go ahead and just swing that right leg all the way to the outer side of the left knee. Nice and tall. Back is straight, palms together twist to the right side and on an exhale look behind you inhale tall exhale bring those hands down for extra support coming back to center go ahead and bring both those feet placed onto the mat we're going to go ahead and let our hips fall to the right now. Inhale, hands up. Exhale, fall to the one side. You may be more flexible on one side than the other, that is okay. Inhale, back up. Exhale, the other. Inhale, back to center. Keeping the right leg right knee on the mat. You can just maybe tuck it behind a little bit, taking the left foot on the outer side of the right knee, palms together, twist to the left side, and on an exhale, look behind you. So inhale, nice and tall, long back. Exhale. and back to center. All right, go ahead and bring both of those feet firmly onto your mat. Hands are behind you. We're gonna go ahead and just let our legs fall from side to side, giving that little counter pose, giving our hips a little massage. fall open and the palm and the soles of the feet are still together go ahead and bring them in as close as you can to your center you can go ahead and take your hands and place them under your pinky toes for extra support and then just lifting the chest or opening the chest rolling the shoulders back and lifting the chin closing the eyes Elongating the spine, adding space. Butterfly pose. Maybe even pretend you are a butterfly. You are a beautiful butterfly that just got its brand new wings. And you are going to fly away into the next level of your life. Exhale, bow the head, chin to chest. Inhale, lift the head, chin goes up. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, chin lifts to the sky, head falls back. It's 
This is really great for your throat chakra. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, lift the chin to the sky. Go ahead and roll your shoulders back, coming into this neutral position. Kiss the legs together. We're gonna go ahead and extend them long down onto our mat. We're gonna go into a nice, long back stretch. So we're gonna go ahead and make this motion of lifting up, reaching forward, pushing back. So reaching up, exhale, fall forward. Inhale, roll back, and then roll the shoulders. Okay, so inhale, hands above the head. Exhale, letting them come down to your ankles, bowing the head, taking a nice deep breath here. Exhale, rolling the shoulders up, lifting the chin. So inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. All right, go ahead and grab your bolster. Go ahead and place it on top of your knees. We're gonna go ahead and just bring ourselves forward and resting our head onto our pillow. And you can even take one ear, you can switch sides. And you just bring the forehead to the mat, or to your pillow, your bolster. This is really going to help you if you have a really hard time bringing your head to your knees. This is a really good starter position. We're just inhaling and exhaling here. Inhale, exhale. Go ahead and roll yourself back up. Go ahead and take this bolster and set it parallel behind you kind of starting at the middle of your back. And then go ahead and just come all the way down, palms to the side of your body. And we're gonna take Shavasana. Inhaling, exhaling, inhaling, exhaling. Giving yourself gratitude for coming onto your mats today and putting in the work and believing yourself and nobody can take away your time. Thank you so much for watching this yoga video. I'm Synergy Shaley and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And I'm going to hang out in Shavasana here for a second.